Hi, this is Buck Baskin with AdultBibleStudyCurriculum.com. In this video, I just really want to challenge you about um, no excuses, not having excuses for your life or um, letting people in your small group make excuses. Uh, we live in a world that's full of it where anytime anything goes wrong, we always want to point the finger if we can't get something done. There's always some excuse or some reason or maybe there's procrastination and there's a reason there's excuses why we're putting things off. And, but that's the world's way of doing things. And we have to remind ourselves that we are not of this world. We are called to live differently. We see again and again in scriptures that, that Jesus did not allow people to make excuses. He had told them to get in or get out. And and the thing is, is that we so often, in the sense of trying to be caring or nurturing or whatever it is, let this go. But we cannot excuse excuse making. We cannot let people slide. We have to raise the bar in our small groups and on our churches and say there are no excuses. Jesus called us to be all the way in or all the way out. And that's what we expect. Um, and, and that's the kind of thing that we need to be doing. Um, it's tough at first. People may not understand, but it's what we have to do, especially as if you're in a leadership role. The thing is here is, of course, be loving. Uh, be loving in the way you go about it, you know, and be understanding when people are going through hurts and struggles and issues, you know, be sensitive to each situation. But know this, that part of being loving is raising the bar. Letting people make excuses, letting people be me mediocre, that is not love. That is not loving, uh, you know, Christ loved like no one ever else ever else had or has since and he never allowed people to make excuses or go halfway so as you begin to continue to lead your group and your ministries i want to encourage you um, to not let people make excuses and don't let excuses be a part of your life either